Rachel Holt for Nesson.com alongside Doug Hyde here at Gillette Stadium. We knew Patriots defensive end Rob Ninkovich was going to retire soon. We just didn't know how soon. Well, today he made it official in a news conference here at Gillette Stadium, and it was truly special. We had Bill Belichick, Robert Kraft, and a number of the Patriots players all filing into the media workroom to show their support. And what's obvious, Doug, is how much this guy is going to be missed. Oh, yeah, definitely. A majority of his teammates were in that room, standing room, sitting on the floor only for these guys. Bill Belichick was sitting on the floor listening to Rob <laughs> Ninkovich as he was you know, giving his, his retirement speech there. And uh, Tom Brady was sitting next to Dante Hightower, smiling from ear to ear while listening to, to Rob Ninkovich speak. So, yeah, it was definitely very apparent how much his teammates really love and support him. Ninkovich said he put in months of work trying to get ready for this season. He just didn't feel like he was where he needed to be at this point. Are you surprised he didn't try to give it another year? I am, just because he did participate in the offseason workout out to the Patriots. So he was here for OTAs. He was here for mini camp. He was lifting with his teammates all off season. But, you know, a month off and you have to start thinking about going to training camp again. I can't really blame the guy, but I am a little bit surprised that he didn't at least try to give it one more year. He was still pretty serviceable last season. But all in all, I think that he was honest with himself as he said he was. I think it probably is the best decision for him to walk away at this point. He joined the team in 2009. He obviously played a huge leadership role with the team. Now, what does his absence do at that position and in general? Yeah, it's it's going to be pretty crazy for the Patriots because it's going to be Trey Flowers on the right side rushing the passer, but no one really knows who's going to be on the left side now. I think that we all kind of had Rob Ninkovich penciled in there. Patriots are extremely difficult to predict when it comes to which players they're going to be using at linebacker, who they're going to be using at defensive end. So we could see guys like Kyle Van Noy or Shane McClellan. They could step in for Ninkovich, even though they mostly played linebacker last season. Could be Coney Ely, maybe one of the rookies, either Dietrich Wise or Derek Rivers. So we'll, try, we'll kind of just have to take a wait-and-see approach here. But Patriots do have the bodies. It's just really about how they want to use them and how they want to replace Ninkovich there at left defensive end. Well, a great career for number 50 mm -hmm. here in New England, and it's very obvious how much he will be missed. For more on the press conference, make sure you head over to Nesson.com.